Good morning. All right, the pamamangawang sarili. Today's topic is the removal of the old kitchen countertop. Okay. First thing first, you need this kind of knife. You, this is a uh, seal or caulk. What you need to do is stop it right there to make sure the paper of this drywall will not peel off okay when you remove this backing all right first thing first see if you want do this when you fill this up this packing will fill up this paper of the drywall okay but anyway and then you have these tools you always want to estimate where the raptor is. I mean, uh, what do you call that? But yes, but it's okay if it get a hole, it'll be okay. Normally, we can do it here. And then lift it up. Lift it up. Okay, nope, you don't want to do it. It's not cooperating. what I'm talking about right there see this this, this is it's been here since 1994 and I bought a new one because the one on the sink is not looking good anymore so this is how you just fill it and these are how houses in America made you know that the thing is called the same thing here I'm gonna Try it from underneath. All right, let me pause that. That way, this video will be short. All right, the back splats are blue. So now it's this counter here. This counter have a four screw, but I'm lazy to go down because it's hard. Let me see if I can get them. Oh yeah. Wait a minute. Let me just do that. I'm just going to remove the screw at the underneath instead of try to break it, pry bar it from the top. Alright, continuation. I already removed the three screws that hold this uh, countertop. So I'm removing the last one and I should just be able to lift it and throw it away. This is still a good counter right here. Maybe I can make something out of it. Uh, what do you call that? A work table? A bench table? But anyway, they have this square head screws. And I have that set that have all kinds of different uh, heads, tips. So, I just kneel down and pray. No, uh, it's supposed to go underneath, but I, I can do it this way without seeing it, just making feel it, you know. There's some things that you can do just feeling it right there. I should just be able to lift this up and place the new one. So this is how easy it is to replace countertops. Remember, I got this house built in 1994. So 1994 to uh, 2021, how many years is that? That's a lot of years, service years. But anyway, I wish I have a small tummy. This kind of work. I used to do this in avionics where I had to crawl underneath confined spaces. But at that time, I don't have a gun, so it's easy for me. This guy is on the way all the time, coffee first. Ladies and gentlemen, like I said, all you have to do now is lift this old countertop. See that? I think I'm gonna paint this uh, counter, I mean this, what do you call that? Cabinets. I think I'm gonna make a workbench out of this. It's a perfect workbench that's laminated. And it's still in good shape because it's hardly used. The one in the sink. It's the one that really in bad shape. That's why I need to replace it. See, 
I wish I had that. Uh, let me just post it or finish it up.